The United States is becoming more environmentally friendly by using more solar and wind energy. Extension educators are helping to make everyone more environmentally friendly by teaching them ways to use less non-renewable resources. Extension educator in energy, John Hay, spends a lot of his time learning about wind and solar energy as well as teaching to people of all ages. This fall, John talked about solar and wind energy in an online field trip that lasted about an hour. He presented about the topics and took questions from students all across Nebraska. Solar panels in the last few years have declined in price, which has caused an increase in people purchasing them for businesses and homes. The UNL Animal Science Building has solar panels on the roof even. John helps monitor the energy activity to make sure the panels are working properly. The Animal Science Building has three different kinds of solar panels. The panels are different because of how the silicone crystals are grown. There are two wind turbines that are close to UNL and Lincoln. Lincoln Electrical Systems, or LES, began operating one of the wind turbines in 1998, and the other was in 2000. The first wind turbine that LES installed around Lincoln is 290 feet tall. Each of the blades are 77 feet. John was able to climb all the way to the top of the wind turbine. He said that it only took about 12 minutes to climb all the way to the top. Once he got to the top, he was able to see the edge of Lincoln, including UNL's East Campus. If you are interested in learning more about alternative energy, go to John's extension page or to the Streaming Science field trip link in the description. John is helping Nebraska go green.